Hello everyone, it's me Waka. Welcome back to my channel. Today is the second part of the Toriba unboxing video. I am wearing this Kigurumi again because I don't know, I feel like, you know, Toreba has to do a lot with plushies, cuteness, and I thought that this really fits this video and I just love this Kigurumi, so why not? Right? <laughs> Before starting this video, I want to say thank you a lot for the people who like and comment my previous video, the first part of this Toreba unboxing because it really, really means a lot. I'm so happy that a lot of people like it and people really have fun. <laughs> it really means a lot. So yes, so on today's video, we are going to unbox the biggest one. I am very excited because on this one, I think we have more bigger prices and that really makes me so so happy so without any further ado let's check this box out this box is huge like it's bigger than the uh, the other one like as you can see here uh, it's heavy uh, oh my gosh i'm gonna lose my breath uh, okay now where's the scissor also something that I wanted to mention is that if you haven't watched part one, please, please, please watch that video before watching this one because it's more fun and you're also supporting my channel, which means a lot. I'm trying to grow my channel and I'm trying to, you know, focus more on kawaii things. Um, I'm planning to do a lot of more fashion hauls. So if you like Japanese fashion and kawaii-ness overall and adorableness, Overall, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. So again, so sorry for making you wait. Um, let's start. You might tell right away a few things on this box. You know what the tail is from. Um, bear back. So the first item on this amazing box, it's no other than it's so cute! We have Slowpoke from Pokemon, obviously. It's so pink and it's so big. I didn't thought that this was gonna be this huge. So awesome! Oh my god! He looks so cute! And here is the tag. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. The only plushies that I have from Pokemon is Pikachu and Togepi because I love Togepi and I actually cosplay Togepi. I think I never show a picture of me cosplaying Togepi. I made that outfit myself. It's the first cosplay that I ever, ever done like completely. Um, I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> I'm thinking on doing more cosplays in the future. Um, I don't know, do you love cosplay? Let me know in the comment below. So this is so, so cute. I don't know what's the fabric of this, but I think this is a very standard um, plushy type of fabric. Like it is soft, but it's a little bit, a little bit, just a little bit rough. Um, but it's so, so, so cute. So this was the first item. Ah, and I also love the ears. I don't know if I'm going to sell Slowpoke because he's so cute. I don't know if I'm going to sell anything from this box. I don't know. We shall see. So the next item is... Oh, oh my gosh. It's pastel. It's so cute. It's Tuxedo Sam. He looks amazing. Wow. I cannot believe that they put him in this very thick kind of bag. Like... This is the only plushie so far that had this really, really thick bag. I guess they wanted to protect him very well. So we have the cutest tuxedo Um It is a licensed product. Let me take him out of here, because please. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I had no idea that this was like a hand warmer. 
I thought that he was just a plushie. Well, he is a plushie. But look at him. Oh my gosh, look at this hard cheeks. It looks so freaking cute. And I love this blue pastel color. Oh, look at the hat. That's so freaking cute. Even has a string for some reason. I don't know why. Um, here is the tag. Um, as you can see, it's a licensed product. So, and here's how it looks inside. This is so cool. I mean, it's pretty hot in here in Orlando, so I don't know if I will ever need this. But he will look very cute just as a plushie. I know that they had other Sanrio characters, but this is the one that I was able to get. But I don't regret it because I didn't have any Tuxedo Sam um, item before. So I'm super, super happy. So this is the second item. The fabric was like a microfiber type of fabric, super, super soft. Now the third item is... This is Sanrio characters. Um, I don't know what this is said here. I guess this is like a towel, kind of. You can see here, Kitty, my melody, Pom Pom Pudding, and Cinnamon Roll. Let's open this up. It's so so cute. It's so big and it's so soft and it's cinnamon roll. This is such a cute blanket. I oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's super soft. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is my first item from cinnamon roll, so I'm very 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 happy. Ah, this will be so nice for when I'm very very cold at night. Oh my gosh. I had a blanket like that, so I'm really 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 happy. And it's so freaking cute. It's pastel. Yes. The next one we have, which was kind of heavy to take out of the box, was this. <laughs> oh my gosh. It has such a big head. On the game, I thought that it was super tiny. Oh my gosh. I gotta take this out of here, like, fast. I picked this one up because I was thinking about my boyfriend because I tell my boyfriend that he is like my bear or something like that. Is it cringy? I can't, I can't. Oh my gosh. It's so freaking cute. Look at this! Um, this is the brand Tori. Uh, I don't. It start with Tori Gu, Tori Gura, Tori Gura. Is that what it says here? I don't know, but it's so cute. And this is from Taito, actually. It's so freaking freaking cute. And even at the bottom, it has like a zigzag stitching, so he is more like a. Well, he's a stuffed animal, but. It's a very cute bear toy. Oh my gosh. It's so freaking cute. And he is so... I love these two colors a lot. They look amazing. As as you can see, his head is almost as bigger as mine. So... I'm so excited because I want my boyfriend to see this plushie and I will tell him that... Hey! This is you! <laughs> Oh my gosh, so 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 cute. I love it. Let's see the next one. The next one we have is... Oh my gosh, so cute! Oh my gosh, it's so cute, Mickey. I thought that I got mini. Um, they kind of look similar, but... So cute. I picked this one because it was a different type of Mickey. You know, it's a fluffy one. Uh, and not like the traditional Mickey, which I don't mind, but I think this one looks cuter. It's super, super soft. I love it so much. I think they have the other um, Disney characters, um, but again, this was the one that I was able to get. 
and here we have the oops, here we have the tag and as you can see it is a licensed product ah look at the tail it's also very very cute and on the picture it looks like it's more of a black but it looks actually more like a charcoal gray kind of color something like that and the pants are not as red as you can see on the camera it's a little bit more faded like it looks almost like like pink kind of but it's a bit cute I don't know if I'm going to sell this one though so I'll see the next one we have is oh, it's my melody and I love it so much because it's a light pink version uh, let's take it out of the bag I just love her eyes and her cheeks are so cute. Oh my god. The cheeks are actually feels more like it has um, a sort of sticker for some reason. I've never seen a plushie that has kind of like a sticker or something as cheeks. But her eyes look so cute and oh my gosh, this pink color, it's so pastel. Um, oh. Look at that, this oh, so cute. She kind of looks like a Tsum Tsum, kind of. I love the legs too. Oh, this is a tag, it's super, super pastel and cute. I don't know if you can tell. Um, There you go, it's a license product by Furyu. Furyu? This is how it looks on their knees. Oh my gosh, I really, really love her. It goes so well with this background. Okay. There's three more items left um, besides this one, and they are huge. Okay. Now this one is also huge, but those two are huge. So the next item that we have is ta -da! it's a Potemusa plushie, and it's just my favorite color, lilac, which is. Woo! <laughs> So cute, oh my gosh, I didn't remember that it had a tutu. This is so freaking cute. And even the ball, oh my gosh, I cannot with this much adorableness. Like, isn't she adorable? I think they had them in three more colors, but I just had to get this color. Like, she is so freaking, freaking cute. And here is the tag. And as you can see, la, 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 la. she's so adorable. You see her tail. It's so cute, so cute. I think you can take out her skirt if you want it, but I'm not gonna do that. But she's so soft, like most of the Potaosa plushy. Mines are still back home in Puerto Rico. Um, I wish I had them here because she would look so cute with all of them together. But I don't know what I'm gonna do with all my stuff that are still there Like I have a lot of my stuff, like most of my stuff there <sighs> But never mind, um, I really love it It's so much like the chicks I don't know if you can tell but the chicks are so 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 cute Even her mouth is so cute um, Just 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 had to love it Of course this is not going to be for sale at all I am very very happy she will look so freaking cute on my desk or on my bed I don't know if you could see the big mountain of plushie that I have right here it's insane the next one I have is another Mamelody plushie but this one is the one with the red hoodie which I love too, but this one is super more cute. She looks like Red Riding Hood. She looks so cute. I never had uh, my Melody plushie or anything from this, I guess, should I call it serious? Like with this type of beanie. Oh my gosh, her head is so cute. Her face is so cute. I don't know the name of this fabric, but it's super adorable. They have this in the light pink version. I wanted both. I wanted both, but I wasn't able to get it. But as you can see here, 
it's super adorable this is like like a very bright um, sherry kind of color it's super super cute the fabric is so soft we have the tail over here and um, here is the tag super cute oh my gosh I don't know what I'm gonna do with all this it's just I feel like I'm in a plushy paradise guys like oh my gosh I love the fabric that they use for this and this now for the two biggest plushies left I don't know which one should I leave for last let's see I just I just love it <laughs> so this one is Isn't he adorable? It's a big Inu Inu Chiba plushie uh, Like oh, So cute I have to open this like where, where This was actually a very fun plushie to get because He was so big on the machine and I was like, oh my gosh, I need to get this plushie. I need to Look at this! Ah. I think they had them in like like with this in blue. I think so. I never had like a Shiba Inu uh, plushie before. Here is the tag. As you can see, it's super cute and adorable. Whoop. And here's the tail. It looks like a donut. And <laughs> and here you can see his butthole. Like, isn't that? Cute. Isn't that cute? And here's on the bottom. Oh my gosh, it's it's so big that I don't know if I can hold it tight. Like I have to do this because it has a lot of stuffing. And I also love his cheeks. They feel a little bit rough, like they were like paint on top. It doesn't feel like they were like early brush. If that makes sense, they feel a little bit rough. You can see his eyebrows so sure and cute. Ah, this light pink color on his ears. I forgot how to call this, but this is um, stitched all around his neck. So you cannot take it out like that easily. You will have to cut all of the stitches around his neck. But I think he looks cute as this. So yeah. And for the last item of this second part, Toreba unboxing cuteness, kawaiiness, thingy, plushies ever, we have no other than Cinnamon Roll! <laughs> it's again a lot bigger than I thought. Super big. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is the first plushie that I ever had from Cinnamon Roll and I'm very happy because it's the biggest one <laughs> Let's open this This is heavy Wow It's so hard to take out of here Okay, we have it, and um, now it feels more heavy and bigger. We have it here. You can see the difference. Like it is as huge as the screen of this camera. It's insane, but I love it so freaking freaking much. I don't even know where should I start. Um, I just stop the face. It looks a little bit more flat than I thought. Maybe it's the stuffing. Like you have to push like this. It's so 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 white. Oh my gosh, this is gonna get dirty very easily. I'll see where should I put him. Oh my gosh, look the tail. Looks like a little white pool. <laughs> and this is a tag I forgot to show you. It's a very cute tag. I don't know if you can tell. But it's 
so, so adorable. Oh my gosh, so cute. I cannot even hug him, like that's how big he is. <sighs> should I sell this one or should I keep it? Let me know in the comments below, which one should I sell? Which one should I keep? This is a lot of plushies. I mean, I don't mind having a lot of plushies, but I don't know. Anything that you want to say, sell in the comment below. So guys, this was my video of today. What do you think about all of this cuteness, madness, cuteness? Isn't this so adorable? I am so happy that I was able finally to do this second part because that box and all of the Toreba boxes were taking a lot of space in my house, well, my apartment, and because I'm also being able to finally do my next um, fashion haul videos. I'm very, very excited for those videos because I bought a lot of stuff <laughs> and even some shoes, the most expensive shoes ever that I ever had in my entire life. And I wanted to show it with you guys. So again, if you like kawaii and Japanese fashion, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video if you like it. I hope you have an awesome day and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye!